Football Frenzy, your daily dose of soccer scoops. Hey, football fanatics. Welcome back to your favorite daily football news brief. Today, we've got a mouth-watering menu of soccer scoops that'll keep you on the edge of your seat. From record-breaking hat tricks to managerial meltdowns, we've got it all covered. One, Messi magic. The king equals Ronaldo's record. Lionel Messi's at it again. The Argentine A's scored a stunning hat trick for Argentina against Bolivia in World Cup qualifying, equaling Cristiano Ronaldo's record of 10 international hat tricks. Messi's magic also contributed to Argentina's 6 0 victory with two assists. Can anyone stop this football genius? Two, Messi's Ballon d'Or boost for Lotaro Martinez. Messi is not only breaking records, but also spreading the love. He's backing Lotaro Martinez for the Ballon d'Or, praising his performances in the Copa America and Serie A. Martinez might not be a favorite, but with Messi's endorsement, he's definitely in the running. Redknapp rages against Tuchel's appointment. Harry Redknapp is not happy, folks. The former Tottenham boss is criticizing the FA's decision to appoint Thomas Tuchel as England manager, preferring an English coach. Tuchel's got an 18-month contract, but Redknapp's not convinced. What do you think? Should Tuchel be given a chance? Or Mourinho's master plan, snatching Ansu Fati from Barcelona? Jose Mourinho's got his eyes on Ansu Fati, and he's willing to do whatever it takes to sign him for Fenerbahce. Fati's struggled for game time at Barcelona since returning from his loan at Brighton. Will Mourinho's charm work its magic? Hi, right, Ronaldo's rant. Frustration boils over after Scotland draw. Cristiano Ronaldo's not happy, and he's letting everyone know. The Portuguese superstar expressed frustration after Portugal's goalless draw with Scotland, sharing a rallying message on Instagram. Portugal's winning streak in the Nations League has ended, but Ronaldo's not giving up. A Mbappe's selfish stance, prioritizing Ballon d'Or over team. Kylian Mbappe's got his sights set on the Ballon d'Or, but his approach might just backfire. The French forward reportedly wants to play only in important matches for France, which could impact both his national team and club performance. Is Mbappe being selfish, or is he just focused on his goals? Seven, Rafinha's rise, shining bright for Brazil. Rafinha's on fire! The Brazilian winger scored twice in Brazil's 4-0 World Cup qualifying win over Peru, showing improved form under manager Dorival Jr. Can Rafinha lead Brazil to World Cup glory? Aiden, Man City's successor, Saga, Amarim in the running. Pep Guardiola's future is uncertain, and Manchester City's already looking for a successor. Ruben Amarim's in the running, but can he fill Guardiola's shoes? Nine, Ronaldinho's blunder. How a large entourage cost him a move to Manad. Ronaldinho's got a story to tell, folks. The Brazilian legend brought a large entourage to negotiations with Manchester United in 2003, complicating the deal that ultimately fell through. What could have been if Ronaldinho had joined the Red Devils? 10. Emmy Martinez's high standards, the pursuit of perfection. Emmy Martinez is a perfectionist, and he's not afraid to show it. The Argentine goalkeeper expressed frustration over conceding goals at Aston Villa, emphasizing his desire for clean sheets and continuous improvement. Can Martinez lead Villa to glory? Bonus highlights. Nico Williams on Lamine Yamal. Williams praises Yamal's unchanged demeanor despite success. Ferguson acts by Ineos. Sir Alex Ferguson's ambassador contract with Manchester United was terminated as part of cost-cutting measures. Messi's impact on MLS. Messi's arrival in MLS has been likened to Michael Jordan's influence on basketball. Man U eyeing Byron Stars. Manchester United is interested in signing Leroy Sane and Leon Goretzka from Bayern Munich. Henderson open to England return. Jordan Henderson is reportedly considering a return to England after a challenging spell at Ajax. That's a wrap, folks. Stay tuned for more football frenzy. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for your daily dose of soccer scoops.